I never had those lights. I don't really know if many people did. It was just on TV. But we're back with some um, obsidian flames that I found at Walmart. Which is funny because I, I had been looking for them and I never found them and then I found a bunch of them. Uh, these come with some promos too, so I got two of the Annihilate Evolution with it. A coin. Uh, they're all the little grass cat. That's cute. I have a few of these coins now and a King Gambit. I didn't have King Gambit. And now I do. So we're gonna open them and yeah, they each come with a pack from Obsidian Flames. We'll see what's in them together. And then likely I will just give these coins to friends because they can keep. Right, so. Do you want the Annihilates first? We'll do a sandwich of that. I always like that in life. So it gives you Mankey. Primeape. And your code. And then here's the Annihilate. Which I do like. I think it may have gotten this one. I don't know if they ever used it in another set. But I still like him. And you automatically get a hollow. So that's cool. Because these weren't, I think they were like 6.98. Which, um, for everything you get with it. Not too bad. I don't know if you guys have any other deals that you found that are better. I like knowing I get a hollow. <clears throat> Let's see what the pack gives you. It has a rever room or whatever that evolves into. I did see some family over the weekend and I was telling one of them that also knows about Pokemon. I was like, um, I don't like the objects that much. Like not, not to dismiss every Pokemon that's an object. But the animals and the concepts tend to work better in my opinion. I do like steel Pokemon. I like when they make an animal steel. And they're like, this is steel. Or Steelix. Steelix is cool. And then the shiny is like golden. If you guys want to share your favorite shiny Pokemon in the comments, please do. I love to talk about that. Because at the be I can't open this at all. I swear they make it harder when it's in a magazine. Anyway, yeah, I think um, it's interesting how the shiny Pokemon, they used to be done through like an algorithm. And it would like you know, change the saturation a little bit, change the hue, like a certain degree. And um, that's why, oh, here's your code. I mean, a lot of codes in this video. If <laughs> each one has two. Um, yeah, but they would go through a pretty much just a list of algorithmic code, right, to each Pokemon sprite, and that's what resulted in a lot of them being kind of green for some reason. But yeah, a lot of the earlier ones were green, and then now you'll see um, they modify it intentionally, right? Okay, you're starting with Houndour. 
Combi. <clears throat> I did see the hollow in this, but I won't spoil it. Dig a dig. Rowlet. Who is this? I think that might be the same person that did the Jinx from the other night. Oh, I can rock. Probopaz. Probopaz is such a funny one to me. Even Nose Pass. Like, you're just a giant stone face nose thing. <clears throat> Lanoon. Definitely based on like an Easter Island head, but Nose Pass, that's such a funny name to like point out its nose. Reverse Altaria, I like it. Look at that. He's just plopped in there. A reverse Rowlet, which I'm pretty sure we got recently. So, okay. And then, yeah, this is cool for the rare. I'm into it. Toxtricity, I don't have him yet. He's a really cool one from, from that. Um, gotta sleeve him up. Sleeve him up. Sleeve him up. Gotta sleeve him up. <clears throat> I like that the set is giving me mons I don't have yet. And they're not the lame ones. Ooh. Like if I ever get. If I ever get a Vanellux, you'll see. Because I will not be happy. I'll be like, oh, Vanellux. Um, and if you guys look up, there's one really funny video on YouTube. Um, you might have seen it, but it's called like Pikachu on Acid. And it's a really funny animation. But <clears throat> at one point in the video, you're doing King Gambit. At one point in the video, <laughs> and they come across like an empty void with a chair with eyes and a mouth, and it's just like, yeah, they forgot about me. Like, I'm the next gen or whatever. And I swear, if they ever make a chair Pokemon, maybe they would if it was like a big enough meme, right? Okay. So we've got a Tyranitar. From what I've heard, Obsidian Flames is pretty good. And I kind of trust, you know, someone who's opened more packs than me for the recent ones. time that's all it was like since fifth gen sixth gen something like that and then we get king gambit so he's cool i do enjoy uh samurai chess pokemon that's really cool to me here's a code guys yeah we'll definitely sleep him too I was watching um, J and J and everything. I think that was his name. 
but he sells Pokemon cards at conventions and stuff. And yeah, that was really fun to watch. I recommend that because it, it gives you an idea of like what other people are looking for. And like how that trading aspect works. And one thing they were doing was coin flipping. So like, say they had a trade in mind, like I'll give you this for 150. And he's like, oh, well, like if we flip, can we do like 140 versus 160? And like, if they win, it would go up, top two. And if they, um, or if they win, it would go down. If they lost, it would go up, right? The cost came out. Which is a little gambly. I don't think I really choose to do that, but it's fun to watch. What well, has Pokemon involved? Claude Sire again. Got him last video. Gramble again. So proud and mighty with his hands on his hips. Yeah, he's just strong in Pokemon Go. Like absurdly fast. Diagonal. Cool. Okay, so we. Oh, see, I love this. I love this set already. Guys, see, I can't show you when they're special until they're wrapped, because this is super special. Secret rare. Secret rare. And again, if you don't know the way you can tell um, if it's secret rare, the the number in the set out of the number in the set so this has 197 cards in the set but this card is number 229 out of 197 so it's over the threshold so it means it's a secret card artisan look and it's gold and i love the art it's a stadium card but I really do like that one. I've never seen it before, I don't know. And then guys, again, an absolute EX. Look at this. This has to be somewhat sought after. This. Kind of in the same style as Nine Tails, and it says it's by the same illustrator, Planita. I've definitely seen since that video. Some of them are done by a company, like one of them is like N Design. But I really like the ones that this artist or group of artists does. I should look into what they are. But yeah. That was an awesome pack. <clears throat> so I don't know if we'll top that, to be frank. Like, that kind of makes the whole thing worth it. So the last one here. We got another Annihilate. And I'll give the duplicates to my friends. She needs some good ones. I was trying to tell her to definitely, if she sees 151, get it, because I look everywhere for it and never get it. I never find it. So if you find it, you're lucky. Okay. I'm gonna go over these again, but... Code? See, I know the Pokemon on the front don't affect it, but that one had Tyranitar and good Pokemon. I didn't even know Absol was in the set. I don't even, I don't really know this set that well. 
I usually am only looking over the sets if I'm like kind of done with it, done buying it. And there's like something I don't know about and I want it. Try the table, I'm done. Adios. You already did that, right? Okay. Another code for you, another code for me. Nothing I'm using. Dark energy. And let's see what happens, guys. I'm going to the Hound Hour. Has to be a queen bee, right? Okay, but Umbrella. I kind of like how they put those things in. They're just. They make sense. Malmar. Another one. Need more Malmar, so they have. Grumpy. from this set, yeah, that's good. Give me <laughs> reverse hollow or skin. A reverse hollow bronze ore, which is actually pretty cool just because the art works with it. And then this one is a hollow clay doll. Not bad. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I do recommend the Obsidian Flames if you guys are looking for them. If you can't find 151, I recommend Obsidian Flames if you can't find either of those or Silver Tempest, because I like that. Maybe Shroud of Cable if I haven't gotten it yet. There are some cool old illustration cards in there. But yeah, you guys, uh, please put your favorite shiny Pokemon in the comments. Uh, if you can give me a like, a comment, a subscribe, or you want to share your own stuff too, feel free to message me. You know, I enjoy, I enjoy Pokemon. I enjoy art. So, all right, thank you.